Hey guys, right, I'm coming at you with another one of these wee electronics kits. Now, you may be wondering why I'm going down the line of these little kits, but um, I will do a video on what I'm hoping to achieve. I'm, I used to be a mobile disc jockey, and I'm trying to create, in miniature, a little disco unit with lights and speakers and strobes and all that sort of thing. So, um, <clears throat> being new to electronics, although I've worked in the electronics factory, I'm new to what the components do and stuff like that. So, I'm interested in um, the sound to light aspect. So, I have a little Velman kit here, which is the MK103 sound to light kit. Now, if you want to get one of these, again, it's great for practicing your soldering techniques. Um, it's only £6.11 on Amazon Prime. I'll put a, a link in down below in the show more if you want to get one. Uh, if you've got Prime, it's free delivery. For, so, six quid. Now, <coughs> excuse me, the other kits I showed you were like level one kits. Uh, this one is like a level two. What does it mean? A few more bits and bobs and that's about it. So it's it's just soldering and, and getting stuff together. So um needs a nine volt battery like this one, which is not supplied. Okay. You need to solder stuff. Um it takes about 0 0.5 milliamps per minute and it has adjustable sensitivity. Let's see what it says on the back. Um, blah, 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 four high intensity LEDs. Light up and react simultaneously to every sound. So the it's got a wee variable pot or resistor um, to adjust sensitivity. Blah 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 blah. Right, let's have a look and see what you get in the kit. Okay, so you get one of the usual nine volt sort of these things, you know, for holding everything. Hold on, I'll just take the camera back a wee bit. Similar to this little strobe one that we did. It just kind of sits on the back. Yeah. Um, what else do we get? We get a bag of components. Ooh, microphone. And a little <coughs> screen printed circuit board. Very well printed. On the back though, it's not tinned, it's just copper pads, but there we go, we circuit board and a strip with four resistors. Ooh. Right, I'm gonna put the other stuff off to the side. Now let's see. Now normally when you get these kits, you open it up and it gives you a bunch of instructions, and it does. So it gives you the circuit diagram. So if you're into circuit diagrams, that is the circuit diagram for the sound to light. Now, my interest in this is obviously um, for making a, a small sort of scale mini disco, I want to have sound to light. Now, the two speakers that I've got, and I'll show you them in, a, in a, another video where I sort of explain where I'm trying to go with this, um, have sort of, uh, it goes like green, green, yellow, red, red, red already, and that's built into sort of the amp chip. Um but I obviously want to do, like, scale disco lights, just because it's a bit of fun and I like model making. So let's just pull the rest of this stuff out. So we've got four uh, LEDs in a bandolier, another separate one here, another one here. Now, uh, I'm going to do a, as I promised to uh, my Patreons and... Um, as I say, this channel is predominantly aimed at model making and how to light up your model kits. I will do a separate series on resistors. So unlike the last one, where I went through trying to identify each resistor by colour band, etc, etc. I'll leave that until I do my main um, sort of resistors video. So, oh, what have we got? I'm just separating out resistors there. We've got a red LED, another, it should be four of these. Okay, so we've got four red LEDs. 
I've got a little pot adjusting screw doofy. There's a the pot. I haven't read yet to see what um, it is. Let me just check, actually. I will check for you. Um, the potentiometer is... Right, so we've got 10K, 330K, 100K resistors. Quite a lot of resistors, actually. Um, the pot, I'm just looking to see if it tells me... The pot is a 220k, so this little pot is 220 kilohms. We have a small condenser microphone. I've not played with these yet. Um, I was waiting until I got Arduino, but um, as far as I know, this one's slightly different. There's one pin is shielded to ground and the other one is positive but I'm not sure about this one so we'll have a play with that um, only one capacitor right okay and what is the capacitor it is a 35 volt 100 microfarad that's a electrolytic so that is a uh, polarity sensitive a screw another screw and we have a one, two, three. This is where the complexity comes in. Oh, jing, so complicated. Four transistors, another screw. And this is quite interesting because normally in an audio circuit, you don't want these um, little, this is a 104. You don't want these little um, ceramic disc type capacitors because they're actually microphonic. Um, that's another 104. Are they all 104s? Yeah, they're all 104s. Because if you actually uh, build a circuit and tap these, um, they're like little microphones. Right, so um, transistors, uh, BC547 which I think is NPN, another 547, another, uh, oh, 557, I think that's um, NPN, or P, sorry, those two, the, the 5, 547s are NPN, and we've got two, Five four sevens, which I think are PNP. So the top two are positively switched, and the bottom two are negatively switched. That's all you get in the kit. So the kit itself is, yeah, it's there's not a lot to it. But you can imagine when I go to do the soldering, it'll probably take me about an hour, like my usual ones. But it's going to be a bit of fun. And hopefully at the end, when we, we make a sound, the lights go. And that's what our ideas I want for circuits for my, my mini disco. So it's me, Terry, from Smooth Workshop. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do and click the little bell icon somewhere down there. Um, I'm new to electronics and I just like sharing what I do. I do waffle a lot, so no point saying you waffle too much, because I already know that. Um, if you do like what I'm putting up between my model making stuff and my electricity stuff, um, do feel free to support me on Patreon. I'll put a wee link up down below. Um, tiers start from a dollar a month. It just helps me get like wee kits like this and, and supports the channel. So again, Enjoy your hobby, whether it be electronics or model making. And until my next video, which will probably be the one soldering this together, it's me, Terry from Smooth Workshop, saying see you later.